Hello my friends, this is Mark Gray and welcome to this keyword research tutorial with a case study. All right, now let me just jump straight to my screen. Okay, so you might have started a YouTube channel, you might have optimized your channel perfectly. If you look on my channel, you'll find a video on how to do that. Okay, so you've created your channel, you want to start creating videos, maybe you want to create videos where you're teaching people something, you're talking about something you love, or you might not even want to have your face on camera. And there is a there is an option for that. And it's something that I've been doing myself and having great success with, okay? So I'm gonna just quickly show you this, all right? There is a software, which I'll put a link to below. It's a paid software, of course. Um, and this is going this is going off the topic of keyword research, but I just want you to know YouTube you can make so much money on and you don't need to show your face, okay, if you don't want to. So I'll just give you a quick example. This is actually a um uh, it's a, sorry, it's a I haven't I haven't upgraded on this one, sorry, because in my other one I have all of the niches open and all of the the keywords that I've already researched and sorry but I don't want to show you them. So I made a quick video here. Um, I'm starting it a little bit because stupidly at the beginning I did say the name of one of my channels. So it plays like this, it goes like this. Can be a silent threat impacting your health in numerous ways. From heart issues to nerve damage, it's essential to understand the risks. But here's the good news. There are natural methods to help control diabetes. No need to rely solely on medications. Incorporating simple lifestyle changes can... Okay, so these videos are made with lots of small videos put together now that's my voice you hear of course um, I do that because I think that it makes it more realistic and I think that sometimes YouTube have a problem with AI voices but if you don't you know if you want to use AI voices you can use AI voices which means no face no voice and you can make faceless channels but keyword research okay so I put in keyword research here. Let's say that I don't have the money to buy a tool or you know use fancy software. I could very easily just find things to rank for by putting in a word. So keyword research. I can see here, so I took away the H at the end, so it's keyword research. Okay, and I can see keyword research for SEO. Now people are searching for that 100%. That's why it's there, okay? But we don't know how many people are searching for that. We don't know if it's still popular. We don't know if a million people are searching for it a month or one, okay? And keyword research for YouTube, okay? That's that's awesome, but we don't know how many people are. So what I do is I use a tool that is called Keywords Everywhere. You might have heard of this already, I mean, I'm going to turn it on. It works on a credit system. It's pretty, I mean, it's very, very cheap, if I'm honest. You can buy a thousand credits. They last, well, they don't, they, don't, they don't need to last a year. But if you don't use them within a year, they take them away. I found, I found that out the hard way and I wrote them a pretty abusive email because they didn't used to, they didn't used to have this credits expire after one year. Anyway, you get 100,000 credits and as long as you remember to turn it off when you're not using it, you know, if you're watching videos on YouTube about whatever you're into, fishing, shooting, knitting, whatever, turn it off because you don't need to see all the data. But when you are doing keyword research, turn it on. Now there's so many other things that this this software can do or this Chrome extension can do, but I'm not going to go into that. I want to go in straight into keyword research. So keyword research. Now if, if I search for it now, it should be very different. Okay, let me refresh the page just so it kind of kicks in, knows that it's on. Okay, so suddenly we have all of these results on the right hand side. And these results are super important because they tell us, okay, so these this here is like the 
trending data. So let's say that you are looking for a keyword. It could be in any niche, you know, not just this uh, make money online world that I'm in. So it could be, you know, something to do with, with herpes, for example. I made a, a video on that recently. I didn't even use my voice, actually. Um, anyway, I can see here that keyword research is pretty consistent. People are always searching for it. It's something that people are not going to stop searching for it. It's also giving me the most used tags, which is pretty useful. It's also giving me, which is super, this is super important, the volume. So I set it to US. You guys can set it to global or whatever country you want. I just set it to the to the US, okay? If I could choose two or three countries, that would be great, but I can't. I can only choose one or other. So I choose the US. Um, and I can see here the volume. So the search volume per month for Google, oh, sorry, for keyword research is 8,100. And the trend is pretty, um, you know, you can see how it is here. Yeah, you can read that. Um, January 2024, 8,100. December, 6,600. November, 8,100. It's very consistent, okay? It's not like it's going, it's going like this down the way. If you find a keyword like that, obviously you're going to be like, oh, no, okay, we'll leave that one alone. Now, there, there is so much more that you can do with this actual tool. And you can see all of these options here. They all have their uses, but for this, I'm just gonna show you what I do. Right here at the top, find YouTube keywords for keyword research, USA. I click that, and what it does is it opens up a page like this, where you can go down and you can look at the keyword, the, the actual keywords, the volume of p the search volume. Now the CPC, you can just ignore because that's cost per click, which is for Google Ads, which we're not, not gonna talk about just now. And you can see again the trend, as long as it looks like this, you know, great, excellent, so these are all these are all great keywords. Now I could technically go and I could choose from these ten different keywords and make ten different videos, and that's great content from for my channel. Now also as well you can and what I would recommend you do so that keywords everywhere doesn't keep refreshing and taking more credits from you is just click CSV or Excel and you'll get a file that looks like this, okay? A lot of numbers, I hate Excel files, you know, I, I didn't, I barely went to school, if I'm honest. So it's got the CPC here, search volume, the trend, and then you can see the numbers, how they go from, I think it's six or seven months, maybe eight months. So from February till January, so it's for one year, I think, okay? And we can see here the volume. Now, Keyword research, great, 8,100. Keyword, keyword research tools, free, that's 8,100. Now, trying to rank for that exact term would probably be, be, be quite difficult unless you already have a lot of subscribers, you have watch time, um, you know, and yeah, then you would maybe try to rank for that exact keywords. Now, for me, what I decided to do was I went through them very quickly. I found this one, keyword research tutorial. Okay, I'm gonna say it again, keyword research tutorial. The reason I'm saying it a couple of times is because when you find your keyword, you should always say it if you can at the beginning, in the middle, and at the end of your video because YouTube picks up on that. It's just another little tip for you. So 210 people are searching from this for the US every month and probably they'll be searching for, you know, maybe very variations, but this is exactly what people are searching for. So they're searching for keyword research tutorial. That's what they're typing into YouTube. And remember guys as well, you know, you can go through this and you can find um, keyword research. So you could make a video on that keyword research step by step and you could make a whole video on that you know very similar to the video i'm making so you could make again you know 10 10 keywords uh, sorry 10 videos from this using 10 keywords 
Um, okay, let's jump back to this. I wanted to show you the little case study that I did. So this channel that I am on at the moment, um, it's a channel called Mark Gray Twum, as you've probably seen. Now this channel I always used for something called um, launch jacking, and launch jacking is basically just product reviews, okay? So what I would do is I'd find a digital product, I would do a quick review of the product, if I liked it, if it was really rubbish, I, I wouldn't of course do it, but if I find a product that I liked, I would do a review, um, and get it ranked to the top of YouTube. Then when people search for that digital product about making money online, they would find my review. There'd be an affiliate link below. Boom, they'd go to my website and hopefully they would buy. Sometimes these videos make anything from 100 to, I think the most I've made is maybe $4,000 from one of these videos. And I'll do, I'll actually do a video on launch jacking and product reviewing because it's a great way to get started. But I wanted to, to, to test and see if I could take this channel to the levels that I've taken other channels because, you know, this was kind of broken down to, you know, kind of just left to do product reviews. But I thought, why not? Everybody knows my brand, so why not just try and grow this channel? That's the idea. So I did keyword research. Now, I, like I said, you click here. And it opens up a page sorry opens up a page like this you have all of the keywords you can you know go down have a look at what ones you want put them into the excel document and choose which one you're going to go for i also did it for get response um, and this is the little case study so somewhere in here um, and on the excel document i found um, get response landing pages so i decided to make a video on how to how to build a high converting landing page and get response okay because that was being searched for now the the search volume was not a million it was not it wasn't a thousand even i think it was about 110 190 but still that is going to get views i made this video yesterday and already has 607 views um, it's getting three views per hour, which I can see from vidIQ. And boom, I have a video at the top of, just let me click it again so you know I'm not bullshitting. So there you go. I'm outranking other people who have, you know, a lot more subscribers, um, bigger channels, just because I did good keyword research with a highly optimized YouTube channel. Um, and I will put a link somewhere to, to watch that video on how to optimize your YouTube channel for SEO. And that's it. That's how I do keyword research. I don't want you, you don't want to spend too much time stressing about it, but you also do want to do it because you know you could create 20 videos with random headlines that sound really cool, but people are not searching for them. So it would literally just be luck for one person to find your video, watch it, and then maybe share it across social media, across Reddit, across wherever. And then, yeah, sure, it would go viral. But, you know, what are the chances of that? So the way that I do it is I do targeted keyword research. I find out what people are searching for, what people are typing into YouTube, or Google, I use this for my websites as well, the same tool. And I type that, you know, I want to know what people are typing in so that I can answer their question. And of course, under the video, I'll have an affiliate link um, if, if that's the case. And that's it, that's how I do my keyword research. Um, I wanted to keep this short and to the point. So I hope it is, any questions, stick the, you know, comment below. I always answer everything, any questions, any comments. Um, and of course, a like and a subscribe would be awesome. Oh, last thing as well. I wanted to show you this. Okay. So this channel, like I said, was basically dead, getting no views. But you can see here. So the on the bottom, um, if I move my mouse, okay, you can see here. On the bottom, my watch... Oh, on the bottom, the average minutes watched is 16, okay? Which is when up, 
by 482% from this one video. Okay, I, I did actually make two videos um, from keyword research around the same topic. The views, sorry, the views have went up 3,342%. Okay, that's a, that's a lot. Sorry, that's the minutes watched. Okay, the views um, over the last seven days up 484%. And you can see the spike in the minutes watched and in the last 60 minutes, 22 views. Okay, that's not bad considering that I just started to try to, you know, take this channel to, and to, to the next level. All right. And that's the power of keyword research. I'll leave it there. I'll put the links below for Pictory in case you're interested. It is fantastic. Um, and I'll put a link below for to sign up to keywords everywhere, which is fantastic. But if you don't have the money, you know, for, for keywords everywhere, understandable, of course, it's only, it's like 20, 20 bucks. But if you don't have that, use the free method that I told you about. Just put the word in that you're thinking of. So let's say diabetes and see what comes up and you'll get ideas for long tailed keywords. All right. And use that to grow your channel <clears throat> get more views, get more watch time, get more subscribers and build a business. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day, afternoon, evening, wherever you are. All right. Thank you. And I'll see you in the next one.